We've captured Bill Gertz from Linwood Food Concern out of Linwood Food, Linwood Grill in uh, Raleigh, just off of Linwood Avenue. If you haven't heard of Linwood, they're doing great things in the brewery there, and Bill is why they're doing great things. He brought a guy with him today, I don't know. Dale, good to yeah, meet you. This is Dale, my assistant. Assistant He's brewer? Doing, yep. So I know something about your background, we'll get there in a minute. What have you done? What, how do you become assistant brewer? I just started home brewing my own beer for a couple of years and volunteered at Gizmo and Tyler Cox, old head brewer there. Yeah. So want to hook me up with that building. Nice, yep. good. Yeah. And you were doing so much work in the Indian system. Yep, I needed someone to help. Well, that's nice. Absolutely. That's good. Yeah, yep. So we talked when you were brand new at Linwood, you had just come in. Mm -hmm. And it's been amazing the reception you've had and the quality has come out of already. Oh, thank Have you. Have you been surprised? Uh, yeah, I'm always uh, no, surprised. You know what you, know you could do. No, oh, yeah. I'm always surprised when, when it's well received and yeah. Award winning even. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Right. I mean, these guys, and that's always a surprise as well. I'm glad. Look, I'm glad you but, can't ever count on right, awards. Right, you can't, yeah. Absolutely. Yep. But that's but it's, if you haven't been to Linwood Grill and drink the beer that's produced right there on site. And it's a beautiful location. You can sit right in the uh, brew pub or in the restaurant, whatever they call the front side, and watch Bill and now Daryl in the back doing their work. Yep, in the fishbowl. In the yep. fishbowl, that's <laughs> right. So they have to be neat and clean and tidy about it. That's right. right. <laughs> so what did you guys bring today? Well, I brought our full Nelson, which is a, I have it on tap at the, uh, at the brew pub. It's a Imperial Red Ale, 8%, about 70 IBUs, and it's brewed with all Nelson Sauvignon hops. And what's on the brew pub is also cast? No, that's all. Oh, all right. Yeah, that's you just cast thing. it yeah, for this. I took a cask of it and I actually added uh, Citra and Amarillo to the cask. Okay, so this is a little different than what we can get in yeah. the tap room. Yeah, yep. A right. little, little difference in the hop character. Yeah. Yeah. Now, have you done a lot of cast work? Yeah, I've done quite a bit. Always for festivals and, and in Michigan and, and here now. Yeah. Is it a special challenge or something the brewers kind of like to do or is it pain in the ass? No, I, I enjoy it because okay. you, you can do so much different stuff with, with one base Your beer. Your creativity yeah, can come out a little yeah. bit. We can hop it, we can spice it, we can, yeah, we can do so much with the same beer. It's great. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. Good. good. I enjoy it. Yeah. So Dale, how's this guy to work with? Oh, he's very easy to work with. Easy? That's yeah. good. We yeah. like that. <laughs> yep. Nice to have a very laid back boss. That's good. Try and, such a learn, and such a learning opportunity. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you know, this guy came well. You can't do it better than this. There's a lot of differences between home brewing beer and how you do it commercially. Absolutely. Oh, I'm sure so. Yeah, we're home brewers too, and it, we got to brew commercially a time or two. Oh yeah, no doubt, right? Yeah, yeah that's we, great. We wanted yeah. to a little bit of an eye opener. Yeah, yeah. It was a huge eye opener, and we thought we had seen a lot of brewers that knew kind of what was going on. Uh -huh. But doing it and hands on doing it yeah. is, and watching it being done is two different things. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Well, enjoy the cast festival today. Thank you so Thank much. You. Cheers.